Hello, this is Catherine from Accelerated Reader. Today, I will be reading A Hug, written by Nicola Manton, illustrated by Magali Garcia. Before I begin reading, I would like to give a big thanks to author Nicola Manton for sending me this book to read on my channel. In the description below, I have included links where you may find and buy this book, as well as a website called guidinglittlehands.com, this website has a lesson plan to accompany this book for parents and educators to start talking about consent and coloring pages. Thank you for listening. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe. For all the children who say yes to a hug and all the children who say no. About this book, a hug was created to help parents and caregivers introduce consent to children as young as two years old. It can be a daunting topic to raise and not easily explain to little ones. Join these characters in discovering the many joys of a hug, as well as the many ways to greet others without giving up bodily autonomy or personal space. Teach your little ones early that they decide when and how they are hugged allowing them to speak up and say no to an unwanted touch. Empower them to find their voice and to know that the decisions they make for their bodies are to be respected. A hug. A hug is like a warm blanket on a cold winter's day. For old friends and new friends, for family, and people we love. A hug can be shared between two people or many people. A hug can say hello and a hug can say goodbye. I like hugs when I'm feeling sad and when I'm feeling happy. I like hugs when I'm feeling tired and when I'm feeling sorry. I like hugs when I hurt my knee and when I'm sick in bed. Sometimes I do not like hugs, like when I'm feeling shy or when I'm feeling scared. That might be the reason why. I don't like hugs when I'm feeling mad or when I'm feeling small. Sometimes I don't like to hug, not for any reason at all. If I don't feel like giving a hug, I can shake your hand. I could give you a big high five or blow a kiss instead. A wave is just as useful to say hello and then goodbye. A fist pump or a friendly nod are gestures we can try. I can say yes to a hug or no to a hug. And you can say yes to a hug or no to a hug. A hug is like a warm blanket on a cold winter's day when we both feel like saying yes. The end. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for listening.